That, my child, is the next step in our evolution. More powerful, more beautiful. Here we go. Hey, hold my beer. Hi folks, David here with Terraintronics. Another new product to show you this week. This is the Keru Castle LED Cloner Board. These boards are tiny, about 10 millimeter by 10 millimeter each, and they come in a pack of 10. They're designed to drive large LEDs, Conway Castle boards, or even vibration motors. These tiny boards don't actually have many holes in them for external connections. They use small solder pads, which are really easy to solder to. Doing so allows the circuit boards to be kept as small as possible and for them to fit comfortably within your 25 and 32 millimeter tabletop terrain. There's a few cool ways that Kiro Castle LED cloner boards can be used. The first is to clone the candle flickering pattern from a small 3 millimeter LED to a 1 watt LED. That's what John did on this recent video over at Tabletop Witchcraft. That LED is able to drive about 50 times more power than that small 3 millimeter LED. In this example, there's a small USB input connector, a Kiro Castle board, and the LED. And with a slight zoom, we can see how easily this has been soldered together. Kiro Castle boards can also be used to drive other different LEDs, or in this case, an external Conway Castle board from a flickering LED. The Conway board here has some very simple orange LEDs on it that don't flicker normally. By using the Kiro Castle LED cloner boards as a flickering power source, the Conway inputs are rapidly switched on and off, controlling all the LEDs in, in parallel. Finally, this board has the ability to be used with a Wemos D1 mini board or an Arduino to take its low current output and drive LEDs, boards and vibration motors with the code that's running on the board. That makes it awesome for driving large LEDs with custom lighting patterns like candle flicker, electrical flicker, lightning sequences and others. Code examples for which can be downloaded from the GitHub page for the Kero Castle boards. Links below in the description. Now if all this looks interesting to you, the best thing to do is to come over to terraintronics.com and pick up some of the boards. The documentation is linked from the directory on terraintronics.com. And once you've done that, come on back to YouTube. Don't forget to like and subscribe this video and comment below with some of your ideas on how you would like to use these high power LEDs or multiple Conway boards in your systems to really lighten up your terrain and add that extra immersion that's going to wow your players. Now if you're a player and you'd like to see your dungeon master or game master or rabble rouser run terrain that pulls people into the game and leaves people in shock and awe, then forward this video to them to share it on your Facebook, Instagram and others. Until next time, thank you for your attention. When you do get some of these boards and build something amazing, please share it back with me. I love seeing what people make with my products. Thanks again and take care. Bye-bye.